presentation. This is Neighborhoods Today. is Dr. A. Kula, and I'm your host here for the Halloween show of Neighborhoods Today. The regular staff is out partying, so they left me down here in the basement to take over for this show. Unfortunately, they don't want me along. I don't know why, but I will do. I have to go by their wishes. Tonight we're going to do a good experiment in between the showing of Dracula we are going to make a talking amoeba. An amoeba is a very, very simple animal, only very, very stupid. But we're going to make a smart one because we're going to put in brain parts, nerves, and a tongue, and maybe a few adenoids, just for the show. So, let me show you how we are going to proceed on doing this. Here's the nerves. Yes, sir, there they are, the nerves. This is my tongue material. Over here, we have the cerebellums. The cerebellums make you able to talk when they get the messages from the cerebrum, which is the intelligence. And these little things here are the adenoids because I think everyone should have some. So all we got to do is we have a giant amoeba in the refrigerator waiting, and that's going to come in the next segment. I'm going to bring out it out here, put in a little bit of the uh, cerebrum, and the cerebellum, and the nerves, and the tongue, with my tiny utensils. I'm not too handy sometimes. Sometimes I chop off fingers, but that's not. What are you, what are you going to do? Most of my thing, I think, oh, it's time for the uh, show. enjoys meeting my great great granddaddy he was quite a host yes now as you can see over here here is the amoeba and it seems like uh, Igor got more of his fingers missing I told him to watch out growing these darn things see what am I going to do with him how can I have a guy as a, an assistant when he has no hands okay now we are going to go and start operating on the amoeba to make it intelligent. First, we take this knife and we cut a slit right down the center. And then we cut another slit right down this center to make a little bit of an opening. 
Okay. Then we take a little bit of cerebrum. It's fresh from a corpse from the cemetery. It's all fresh and fell apart when I tried to cut it up a little earlier. Now we're going to insert the cerebrum uh, into uh, the uh, amoeba. Oh, 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 come on, get in there. Uh, uh, actually, I should have put on my surgical gloves and whatever, but you know, I have plenty of malpractice insurance. And amoebas usually don't sue. Okay, now next we're going to put in a little bit of the cerebellum and brain stem. As you can see here, that has to go right by on the cerebrum. Up, oh, up, oh, I got a little bit of blood here. I need to do a little bit of a, where's my blood? Oh, a little transfusion. A little, it's a little, it's a little bit, uh, you know, uh, coagulated because it's been lying around a little while. Uh, that should help him. Uh, 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 there's a little bit more blood in there for you. Yes, yes. Oh, oh, take it easy. You'll be a real Einstein by the time I'm finished. Okay, now we have to put a little bit of the nerves in. Really, why we have to put nerves in? In order to have the transmission of the intelligence from the cerebrum to the cerebellum. Ah. Now we have a little bit of nerves. Yeah. <laughs> ah, they look nice and fresh. Of course they are. Igor only gets the best bodies. Yes. Ah. Ah, we stuff some in there. Ah, yeah. Yep, 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 yep. Ah, we put some more. Yeah. All right. Ah. Oh, we got to get this one over here. Yeah. Oh. Uh, oh, more, more, more blood, more blood, oh, more blood, oh, there, yeah, more blood, oh, oh. yes, yes, ah, oh, that's it, good, 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 you do fine, oh, I need, uh, well, I don't have anything, so, <laughs> we're a little messy today, okay, now we got to put some, some adenoids, where are my adenoids, uh, my adenoids are over here, behind my cerebellum, ah, oh, yeah, everything has to have a little bit of adenoids, yes, sir, yes, sir, yes, sir, uh, Yep, a little bit of adenoids there. Ah, now we got maybe we got another little bit of an adenoid too. Yeah, we got two adenoids. Okay, he wants two adenoids. We put two adenoids in there. All right. Now the part that's going to be very very tricky is the tongue, since my hands are full of garbage. I don't know what I'm going to do. I just have to take some of my tongue material here, and uh, let's see. There I go, I got my trusty knife and I cut out a tongue slice. Ah, that looks like a tongue. Ah, ah here you go. Ah, maybe give him a couple of tongues. May make him two tongues. Why not? He never existed before. This is going to be the first talking amoeba. Yes, there we go.
And now Renfield knows what a kind of a housekeeper my great-great-granddaddy was. He wasn't too good. Now we're getting things back. We've had a little bit of a complication with our amoeba. So the uh, producer of my show has gave me some surgical gloves and a surgical hat. Isn't that nice of him? Let's all hear a good cheer for the producer. Thank you since it's the producer doing the clapping himself. <laughs> okay, now we have to get into this amoeba because I find out that it's a pregnant amoeba and we have to take out the egg. So now I have to search for the egg because we cannot have a pregnant amoeba getting too intelligent because then you know, it screws everything up. Ah, ah, here, here it is, we find the egg. Ah, ah, okay. No pregnant amoeba anymore. Okay, the abortion was successful. Okay, now we go back to the uh, operation. So now we have to put some more nerves in it. Yes, sir. Eh? More nerves up, up, up. More nerves up. Oh, look, we got a little bit of bleeding here from the abortion. Up, 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 up. But okay, get some more. Yeah, there we go. All right. Now. We uh, have to take, uh, get, to get rid of this thing over here. We don't need this over here. Ah, okay. Now, we're gonna put a little bit more tongue material in. I've noticed that I only use the best of, uh, be the best of knives here. Very sharp. I just gotta watch out if they chop my own fingers off. There we go. Doesn't that look good? I hope he starts talking soon. All right, maybe we need a little bit more cerebrum, huh? Ah, oh, well, we have some parts here. I have to tell Igor to stop getting such fresh parts. Only go and dig up the dead that are dead for at least five weeks, not two days. And the people, they don't like that either. It's very, very touchy business, uh, this grave robbing. You know? Oh, let's see here. What do we have here? Oh, what? Oh, my tongue material is over here. Oh, okay. Well, let's see now. Uh, what else do we have to do here? Oh, I don't know. I can't see anymore. My eyes have gone blurry. Oh, what do we have here? Oh, that Operation. I'm using my operator's manual here. You know, I'm, I just graduated from medical school not too long ago, you know? So, I, I, I had to take my time. 
Oh, well, while I'm studying my manual, let's go back and see how Renfield makes out with... back again. How did you enjoy that segment? I hope you had. While it was on, I had consultation with my fellow ghouls, and they said that I should try to put a hand on the amoeba too. So Igor, since he's been chopping up his fingers lately, I have a few fingers here in order to make a hand. So what we're going to do is replace this finger here, and we're going to try to make not only this a talking amoeba, but an amoeba that could also, you know, have, you can pick up a beer and drink or have a little bit of wine, which I will have in a few minutes. Yes, that tells me that they we do this. Ah, oh, yes. Only Igor could keep on chopping fingers off. Huh? How do you like that thumb, huh? How do you like that thumb? Where, what camera am I? Oh, there it is. See, look at that thumb. Um, ah, 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 ah. There he goes. So now, uh, my fellow ghouls, I think that uh, looks like pretty much like a hand now, doesn't it? Okay. I have a little bit more blood. Okay, blood. We need blood. We blood around the fingers because we 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 uh, to, to cut them. You know, you have to circulate the fingers into the fingernails, and you know, so the fingers don't get gangrene. Ah, and we don't want gangrene fingers now, do we? Yes. Okay. Let's throw a few more nerves in there too. That's to actu actuate the fingers too. You know, they need nerves and nerves from the cerebellum and the cerebrum, and. Uh, <laughs> oh, well, now we got to go back to uh, the uh, show.
you like that show? Granddaddy in action. Hope that woman had type A blood because that was his favorite type. He loved type A blood. So now we have done all we can do so far with the amoeba. Except that it seems like it's bleeding over here a little bit. So I have to do a thing and it's starting to decompose. I hope I did not, you know, screw this up a little bit too much. You know? Oh, we put them back in. Ah, that's it. Okay. All right. Now, what we have to do is hopefully now the amoeba will talk. Now, this might take a little bit of a shaking here in order to mix everything in. Oh, mix it all up. Yes, sir. Come on now. Okay. Ah, uh, let's go this way over here. Oh, no, 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 nothing. No, no, nothing here. Come on, talk, amoeba. Talk, come on. Let's go. Happy Halloween. That's it. Happy Halloween. Ah, success, Happy success. Halloween. I've made my talking amoeba. Us. I'd like to thank uh, Dick Mahan and uh, the rest of the crew here for having me. And maybe they'll have me next year where I will try to take a vampire and change him into a werewolf. Doesn't that be nice? So I guess until next year... Uh, this is uh, Dr. A. Kula signing off from uh, the uh, laboratory in the basement of Neighborhoods today. Have a nice time. Happy Halloween. Happy, Happy Halloween. Halloween. That's it. Happy That's Halloween. it. Yes, yes. A success. A success. Happy Halloween. And remember, have a necklace of fresh garlic hung around your head if you want to stay healthy and not get a visit from this old doctor. <laughs> Ha, 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 ha,